Now coming to the shift and rotate instructions of 8086, we have seven or eight uh, shift and rotate instructions in 8086. These are the names. The first one is SAL and SHL. This is nothing but the arithmetic or logical left shift. Left shift arithmetic and left shift uh, logical. So this is the way in which we classify the operands. This is the algorithm. Each bit is shifted to one position, shifted one position to the left. That means if this is the content in a register, this is the carry flag, this is C. Then after the execution of this um, SAH, each bit is shifted to one position to the left. That means this will now become this this come to this point this come to this point and so on similar to the previous one we have already studied in 805 this is this this comes to the carry flag so this value will come here and next lsb is cleared to zero this will be cleared and the bit value which will come after the operation is a zero and MSB is moved to CF carry flag. MSB is moved to carry flag. So if we have E0, that means 1110 and 0000 in the AL register, then after the SAL, we have this one will go to CF and these 1100 and 000 will be shifted to this uh, MSB side. And one zero is inserted at the MS LSB end. So the accumulator content will be like this. See, this one is shifted here. This one is here. This one is here. And so on. Every single thing is here. This zero, this bit LSB is vacated. This has to be cleared in this instruction SAL. Next is SAR, that is shift arithmetic right. Now we shift the bits to the right that means this way and so on and this will be in the carry so this is carry this is the al for example i have chosen al as e0 e1110 and 0000 this is e and this is 0 and after the operation what is the algorithm? The algorithm is that MSB of the destination is filled with its previous value. So the sign is preserved. This one will be same. So this one has to be there. LSB of the destination is moved to CF. So LSB is moved to the carry flag. Right. So this one will be this and every single bit is shifted. So this will become this one will be one this one is shifted this one is shifted to next this one is shifted to next so we have one 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 and then zero 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 and this zero will come to the carry flag so this will be one 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 and zero 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 here is the example the carry flag zero bit comes to the carry flag the m lsb will come to the carry flag and this one is kept one and then one 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 is shifted to the right one bit is shifted to one bit to the right and uh, this 0, 0, 0, 0 and this one 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 will be uh, f and zero so f zero will be the answer right next is shr shr stands for shift logical right now logical right that means we shift it one by one this comes to this and instead of having this one as it is we will not get this one because arithmetic shift maintains the sign here the logical shift does not maintain sign so if this bit is getting empty then this will be set as a zero so msb of the destination is clear to zero msb of the destination that after the operation the msb will be cleared and each bit is shifted to the right this lsb will go into the carry flag 
to make it zero or one whatever the value of the lsb is and here is this zero is shifted and if we shift this one here this one next to next bit this one is to next bit and so on then this one 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 zero and zero 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 will be the answer I'm sorry this is one this zero 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 right this is already shifted to zero this is not and this will be zero 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 and what about the msb msb will be cleared to zero that means this first bit is zero so this will be zero one 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 that means seven and zero 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 that means this so this will be the answer carry flag will be the lsb of the previous uh, uh, data in the register so this zero will come to the carry flag. clear next is rotate right without carry r o r that means rotate bits to the right rotate bits to the right that means rotating bit to the right and cf gets a copy of the lsb obviously if we rotate bit to the right that means cf will get the copy cf will get copy of the lsb so this cf will be zero and this zero is going into this because we are not incorporating carry in the rotation so this zero will be the cf this one become come to the second msb this one will come to this third msb and so on so this zero will be the msb now so this this will be zero is one 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 and zero 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 and the carry flag will be zero here is this carry flag and the zero comes to this place and every single bit is shifted to the right so this will be uh, 0 1 1 1 and 0 0 0 0 here is the answer 0 1 1 1 and 0 0 0 0 that is rotate right without carry next is rotate left without carry. that means every single bit is shifted to one bit left and msb will be the carry flag and since we are not incorporating rotation operation uh, carry win in rotation operation that means msb will become the lsb so rotate bits to the left and cf gets a copy of the msb that means this carry flag will be one whatever its previous value is and this one will go to here so this will be one one zero zero and zero 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 one so the answer will be carry flag is the msb of the previous operation previous uh, uh, content of the register and this one go to here and every single bit is shifted to the left rotated to the left that means this one will be one one zero zero and zero 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 this one has come to the ms lsb so this one will be a one one zero zero and zero 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 one next is rcr that is rotate right through carry now rotate right through carry it means that rotate bits to the right and cf gets the copy of the lsb it is same as the ror but we are rotating through the carry that means carry is now a part of the rotation so this cf will be the L lsb of the previous value of the register and this zero come to this particular place msb so this will uh, will be uh, 0 1 1 1 and 0 0 0 0 and carry flag will be 0 so here is 0 that means this and that 0 of the carry flag will go to the msb side so this one will be 0 1 1 1 and 0 0 0 0 so here is the result of the uh, rcr operation now the next is rotate left through carry rotate left through carry that means we are rotating bits to the left in this operation we are rotating through carry that means carry is a part of the rotation cf gets a copy of the msb so if we are rotating left that means this come to this place this come to this this come to this and so on this come to the carry this carry is incorporated in the rotation operation so this will be rotated to the lsb of the uh, register content so this will be the this one will come to the uh, carry and this zero this zero will go to the lsb side so this one this uh, uh, the content of the al will be uh, one one zero zero and zero 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 and this is here 
1100 and 0000 ca will be 1 ca will be 1 this one this zero of the carry flag previously carry flag will be will be available to the uh, lsb of the data this zero comes here and every single data is rotated every single bit is rotated to the left uh, so the answer will be 1100 and 0000 okay